Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Anuj. I'm Faizan. And uh, in this video, we are actually going to do something very interesting. It's not uh, the general type Reaction of music video. videos that we do. It is about uh, 10 surprising facts about Bangladesh. Bangladesh. Yeah. Uh, and meanwhile, we do that. Subscribe to our channel. Click on the bell icon. Stay updated with us. Let's go. We're visiting the country of Bangladesh in this episode. Now, Bangladesh is an extremely beautiful country and it's filled with all sorts of wildlife and lush environments. It's definitely a country to add to your list of places to visit in Asia. Hey guys, how's it going? Hope you're doing awesome. My name is Leroy Kenton. And now, honestly, if you're not having the best day, it's about to get a whole lot better after you finish watching this episode. So make sure you watch this video all the way up until the very last fact, trust me. Okay, so let's jump into the facts. Now, starting at number 10, going all the way down to number one, the first thing to note is that Bangladesh was not always known as Bangladesh. Before 1947, in the British rule India, Bengal or Bangla was a province, and in 1947, it was divided into West Bengal and East Pakistan. So what does the word Bangladesh even mean? So when you take a look at its root, it means the country of Bengal, and it can be traced back to the early 20th century, when Bengali patriotic songs used this term. The term Bangladesh was often written as two words, Bangla and, of course, Dash. Now the term Bangla denotes both the Bengal region as well as the Bengali language. Bangladesh's capital city is Dhaka and it has a growing population of about 20.2 million according to the latest numbers in 2019. Now it was at one point the most densely populated city on the planet. Now not to be confused with the most populated city in the world, Dhaka had a population density of 23,234 people per square kilometers. Now to calculate population density, you gotta divide the population by the size of the land area. So population density equals number of people divided by the land area. Fun little math equation for you today. Now when we take a look at the flag of Bangladesh, you'll see a red disc in the middle. Well, that represents the rising sun and the sacrifice to achieve independence. Now the green symbolizes the green fields and the lush environments of Bangladesh. Very simple. Yeah, that's pretty much the flag. Very, very symbolic. Like honestly, when you see images and video clips of Bangladesh, you'll see what I'm talking about when I say it has a lush environment. Bangladesh also has a world record. The most people singing a national anthem simultaneously is 254,537. And it was achieved by the Ministry of Cultural Affairs, the government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh, at the National Parade Ground in Dhaka, Bangladesh on March 26, 2014. Now the Philippines, they tried to break this record, but they only had a total of 94,584 people actually turn up, but their target was to have 300,000 people singing their national anthem. So yeah, Bangladesh still holds this record to this day. Also on December 11th of 2004, over 5 million people joined hands to form a human chain. And the chain was 1,050 kilometers or 652.4 miles long. And this trip from the city of Teknaf to Tentulia, Bangladesh. The participants were supporters of the 14 opposition parties led by the Bangladesh Awami League to express their no confidence campaign to the BNP-led alliance government and to demand fresh polls. So that's another world record that Bangladesh has. Now you see this guy right here, his name is Paramal Chandra Barman. Now he was born in 1962 in Bangladesh. Then at the time it was known as East Pakistan though. Now he was considered to be the tallest person in the world back in 1991 and he stood at eight foot three inches tall. Sadly he passed away in 1991 due to a tumor on his pituitary gland which was actually the cause of his incredible growth. Now what's crazy is that he also suffered from malnutrition. So you don't have to be small and shriveled up to be malnourished. This was one thing that we learned with him. A whole lot of interesting going on over in Bangladesh. For the next fact, we look at the sport of Kabaddi. Now, Kabaddi is the national sport of Bangladesh. However, cricket and football are considered to be the most popular sports in Bangladesh. Now, if you aren't familiar, Kabaddi, it's sort of like an intense mix of tag and cat and mouse. Like, people get like real into it. It looks pretty fun though. I've never played it myself, but uh, 
Yeah, I wouldn't mind that at all. <laughs> oh, this is the Indian no, Pro Kabaddi. Another interesting thing about Bangladesh is that there are two main rivers that run through the country. Ganga There's Brahma. the Ganges River as well as Brahma the Brahmaputra Rivers, and they Good are holy to the Hindus. The Ganges yeah. Delta is formed mainly by the large flows of the Ganges as well as the Brahmaputra Rivers, and it's the world's largest delta at about 59,000 square kilometers, which yeah. is about 23,000 square miles and it flows into the Bay of Bengal there are often floods however because of these two rivers there's just so much water flowing through them and finally Bangladesh is among the top five countries in the world with the lowest body mass index or BMI the least of these countries in the world have obesity rates lower than 2% now the other four countries are Ethiopia Nepal Eritrea as well as Madagascar Bangladesh's oh. BMI average is 20.5 for women and 20.4 for men. And what's interesting is that more than 9 million children, which is more than half of all of the Bangladeshi children, are underweight and suffer from stunted growth. So hopefully these figures change in the years to come as the country continues to thrive. So now this was our first trip into Bangladesh that we've done in a long time. Bangladesh is a very unique country with several achievements and aspects that have even made it to the record books, as well as the country will forever stand out among nations for years to come. So now let me hear from you guys. Sound off down below in the comments section. And also if you have any suggestions for future FTD Facts episodes that you'd like to see, leave those below as well. Yeah, so I'm, I'm hearing most of the things for the first time and it was good to hear many facts. And it's like 2019, so it's not old at all. Mm -hmm. So what do you have to say? Mm -hmm. Though they made into you know like Guinea's Book of World Record and all of that, yeah. uh, I didn't know any facts about this except for the river one. I didn't know any other fact, and also a man, tallest man, also was mentioned. How much was he? Eight? Uh, eight two or eight one? Eight eight foot three inches maybe. Eight foot three That's inches, like I can't oh imagine. And he was suffering from malnutrition. Yes, I think you better understand pituitary gland something. There was something pituitary wrong gland secretes GnRNA. I know. So, like it hmm. secreted too much or what in his body? Yeah, I I don't know much in detail, but when the growth hormone is like secreted mm -hmm. by the pituitary and all of that, okay, it should obviously be balanced, right? Nothing yeah. should be too much or too less. So when it was secreted mm. too much, and that's how. But yeah. it would also lead to other problems also, you know, mm -hmm. obviously like, uh, working itself, you know, it will be very difficult. So when they say that the body mass index, index you know, on average of uh, people of Bangladesh mm. is like comparatively low, it means that people are not fat, they like the obesity and uh, diseases leading obesity. from obesity. obesity are not an issue for the country, right? If you talk mm. about the medical terms, what do you say? Yeah. And also, what did you speak about then? Um, he made a great video. Yeah, made yeah. This. The guy made it. It was a short video with a lot of information filled in. Yeah. Um, and what else? Yeah, the national anthem record that was great to hear. Wow. Yeah, I, how can I forget that? Yeah. Yeah, and uh, Ganga Brahmaputra, they both uh, come from India, India to Bangladesh and they unite there and then yeah, finally Bengal. join the Bay of Bengal. That is the holy thing which happens in Bangladesh, and that is why Bangladesh, I think, is not uh, you know, is not uh, like scarce of any water resources as such. Okay, and like many countries uh, would be facing. Start off by saying that it is a place you know which you have to add it in your list if you are visiting other places as well mm -hmm. because it's a very good place to visit. Uh, one thing I actually noticed, uh, like uh, mm -hmm. I actually thought that the the green texture of. Uh, you know flag the, yeah the green texture which is there in the flag of bangladesh is actually similar to the green texture of pakistan i actually yeah. thought that but it's not that case the green texture of pakistan guys is even darker and mm. uh, of bangladesh it is little bit uh, fade up yeah yeah oh, yeah, yeah so yeah. that is what uh, i saw and uh, so if you actually see the the red spot isn't not is is not exactly in the middle hmm. you understand why is the reason why because uh, they will have to keep it a little bit here because when the when the flag is you know hoisted and uh, when the air blows so what happens that? that the later part of the flag 
can gets you know curled up by the air so it's important that the the red mm, whatever that the red disc as i said it's is visible. important that it should be visible as well so if you keep it in the middle so uh, you may not see right it would just be a green That's flag the then if you see the the flag of bangladesh it's not exactly in the center it is Makes a little sense. bit towards tilted towards the left left, left side. part that is one reason i had studied this earlier so i could tell about this mm, that's uh, good yeah and the des- density as i talked about it was the most uh, the capital of bangladesh was the most densely populated city in the world at a time i don't know what is the situation right now is it the same million. is it the same but uh, i think <laughs> i don't know what is the problem with uh, you know the bengal region all because uh, that's a different fact guys but if we talk about india the west bengal which is uh, which left with india we have west bengal in our country and if if we have a fact to tell that the densely populated city in india is kolkata which is the capital of west bengal india so i think the whole bengal region used to be you know like people used Did to stay very close to each other it to be polluted no i don't think so not polluted populated Don't think so. So yeah, that was that was good, guys. And if you really liked uh, our reaction, or if you have anything like uh, even you have to say about Bangladesh, because this was a fact to video, okay? So yeah. you might also have something to add. Your yeah, opinion. you guys please can share do it that in the, in the comment section, section below. Uh, we we are really happy to watch it for. And uh, like the video, share with other people, and, and subscribe, uh, subscribe to our channel, the like in. And uh, with that said, we'll see you in the next video. Until so, next time, take care. Bye bye. See you all.